The dawn of bluegrass music, when the roots of a genre dug deep into its namesake grass in western Kentucky, forever changed the sonic landscape and gave rise to a new American art form. Bluegrass music's genesis can be tracked to Rosen, Kentucky, to Uncle Penn's cabin and the home place of bluegrass music founding father, Bill Monroe. Today, the famed Jerusalem Ridge is still filled with bluegrass music. And just a short trip up the road, you'll find a city where a river of music flows, where you're invited to discover its deep roots in bluegrass music. And heritage and harmonies converge. It's a community that's just like the music it's home to, welcoming and authentic. This is Owensboro, Kentucky, and this is the bluegrass music capital of the world, a claim that comes with a clear case for the honor and a big commitment to build upon it. Owensboro is home to the International Bluegrass Music Association's very first office, and it's the home of the brand new and prominent Bluegrass Music Hall of Fame and Museum. Visitors can interact with the history of bluegrass music and the people and instruments who made it. Tours are available through limited time exhibits, permanent features, and the Hall of Fame. The live performances of today's best in bluegrass music are featured in the museum's state-of-the-art Woodward Theater. Lesson programs are thriving and designed to make bluegrass music more accessible to develop the skills and passion of the next generation of pickers and fans. And when it comes to music festivals, there are few as impactful as Romp, an annual celebration of bluegrass music in Owensboro held at Yellow Creek Park, a scenic 150-acre location with beautiful hiking trails, forested areas, and a large lake. Live music performances from the biggest names in bluegrass music occur day and night with instrument workshops, meet and greets, yoga sessions, and dance classes. There's something for everyone. Tens of thousands of fans have made their way to the festival every year since 2003. 2021 marked the beginning of the next chapter for the historic Kentucky State Championship Old Time Fiddlers Contest. The contest has a new home at the Bluegrass Music Hall of Fame and Museum in downtown Owensboro. More than ever, the city of Owensboro and its community leaders are making a solid commitment to partner with other essential members of the bluegrass community who want to share in the vision and energy building in the city. To do this, the city wants to work closely with key bluegrass events and businesses to help them become even more successful and to build even more bluegrass energy in Owensboro. The city and its leaders are exploring impactful incentives and strong marketing support so business owners and event producers can more easily realize their dreams and enjoy the synergy of a community supporting and enjoying bluegrass music. And with Nashville and Louisville each only two hours away, there is easy access to many music fans and professionals. Not only is there a strong business case for those in the bluegrass industry to be part of the Owensboro community, but there are also strong personal reasons the city has blossomed over the past 15 years and is a wonderful place to call home, a friendly, small-town feel with a big city infrastructure to support economic success. This is your invitation. We invite you to be a part of Owensboro, where you can enjoy our revitalized downtown, discover amazing restaurants, and find a place welcoming to everyone. Opportunities abound with our world-class amenities and a hometown feel. And share in our commitment to music that matters, music that is rooted in heritage, we celebrate this music and the stories behind the music. Please come and be part of the bluegrass music capital of the world. 